Welcome back friends once again here is another problem of finding derivative by definition uh, you can say by first principle method question is here we need to find out the derivative of x to the power 1 by 2 so I'm going to suppose a function that let y equals to x to the power half or this I can write as a root over x also so here again as we used to do the process right in previous videos delta x tends to here I'm going to suppose delta x is a very small increment in x and similarly delta y is a very small increment in y so now my function will change somehow like this y plus delta y is equal with x plus delta x root of. okay so in next step I will keep delta y one side and rest of this everything into the right side as I was telling since many videos so it will be x plus delta x minus this y it will be so in next step delta y equals to x plus delta x minus y so in the place of y I can put this root x so it is root x okay so here what we can do further yeah in this problem generally whenever we get the root we have to rationalize it by taking another uh, sign here is minus so I will rationalize it by taking plus so x plus delta x plus root x all divided by x plus delta x plus root x by doing so actually this will form a formula or identity x x this y this y so x minus y and x plus y that is x square minus y square or you can say suppose if this is a and if this is b this is also a and this is also b then it will form a square minus b square formula and that is you know uh, I mean a square minus b square formula which is actually a plus b and a minus b a plus b times a minus b so here a plus b times a minus b or simply you can say a minus b times a plus b so that's a square minus b square so now I'm gonna use delta y equals to now x plus root x inside the root right a, uh, root over x plus uh, delta x whole square minus root x whole square and then whole divided by x plus delta x root over plus root x so in next step what can I write delta y is equal with now this will be a square so you'll get x plus delta x and this will be minus x and then whole divided by x plus delta x root over right and again root over x so this minus x and plus x will cancel out and finally I will be left with delta y equals to delta x divided by root x plus delta x plus root x so now here what I have to do as we used to do in previous videos I will divide left hand side as well as right hand side by delta x and I will take limit delta x tends to 0 therefore I can now write limit delta x tends to 0 delta y over the delta x is equal with limit delta x tends to 0 now it will be delta x whole divided by x plus delta x plus root x and since we have divided here del by delta x because dividing both sides so I need to divide this whole quantity by delta x so my this delta x and delta x will cancel out right and I will be left with limit delta x tends to 0 delta y over the delta x will be now limit so delta x tends to 0 that is 1 over x plus delta x and inside the root delta x so now let's plug the delta x tends to 0 value then what we're going to get yes this will be 0 this will turn out to 0 and I'll get now this will be also you can say del dy by dx or if you want to write then you can write the same thing also that will be now here it will be now 1 over because I am going to put the approaching value of delta x delta x is approaching to 0 so it will be x plus 0 root over x so it will be 1 over 2 root x that's my answer right so my answer is here now 1 over 2 root x so here also we did the same process right I'm doing this different different types of problem different different uh, uh, example I'm taking just to give a model to do uh, just a, a kind of sample to do your all problems right I will take one or two samples from all types of the problems of finding derivative and I hope that will help you definitely it will help you to uh, get the derivative by the first principle method and later we'll do other methods also of finding derivative alright so we'll meet in the next video bye bye